Happy holidays, Autobahn Dan here. It is advent calendar season, and today we have a calendar from the KGB. Oh wait, nope, it's the KWB from Germany. <laughs> Wrong country. Oh, this Santa might get mad at me for saying that, but uh, looks like he has good taste in power tools there. <laughs> uh, let's get on to it, and let's get inside and see what is inside this bad boy. Okay, now it's December 1st, and if I do not hurry, he's going to charge double. <laughs> As you can tell, yeah, he probably would. <laughs> so KWB is a German hand tool manufacturer. Uh, they make DIY hand tools and um, drill bits and uh, power tool accessories. And they have a Craftsman line, I believe. I just briefly looked into them. That is um, multi-tools, bits, and abrasives, and stuff like that. Um, so that's what they do over there. And uh, you know the reason why I bought this one is because uh, it's got a bottle opener in it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's uh, get the part number here. You can clearly see. There you go. It's uh, pretty similar to the uh, Vera with the uh, stand right here. All you gotta do is uh, poke her on through. And there you go, got a nice stand there. And you got the hooks right there. You can hang it up on the wall. Another similar uh, feature there. So uh, this one came in just a plastic bag that says this is not a toy. <laughs> and uh, compared to the uh, Vera, Vera comes in an outer shell and then you take the uh, inner shell out for all the pieces so you don't poke on through all the pieces out. So hopefully uh, pieces aren't flying all over the place. So let's get on to it. Okay, so if you look closely, there is tape at every seam holding it together so I guess that's what's keeping all the pieces from flying out so let's uh, cut the tape for the first day here and I believe I'll just go through each one individually a little faster pace but uh, we'll uh, guide you through number one here looks like you gotta find the tape here So that will definitely fight you. If you have children, looks like they will have issues trying to open this. So, oh, and once again, <laughs> this is not a toy. <laughs> so definitely keep that in mind. All right, on the first day of Christmas, we get a loose bit. <laughs> Oh man, here we go. The first day right here. We have, similar to the Vera, you get the case. So the case is a pretty basic case here. Oh, just the, the bungee, uh, the elastic stitched into the door. Get the four here, two big ones there, there, and that. And then a whole bunch of little ones here. So pretty basic. It is made, no, no made in anything here. So just an address. So just basically your zip up case. Oh, this is nice and rubber right here. Toughest nylon workwear. Not too shabby. And this is made out of rubber too. A little flimsy, but uh, not bad. Okay, so I'm just gonna cruise on through each one and uh, we'll see if we can find all the pieces. <laughs>
my gosh, that was a disaster. Looks like I have everything here. Nothing's rattling in there. <laughs> oh my gosh. I get I think the worst one was this. I don't get how this is going to be a safety here, but that's the safety. You have to hold on to it while using it, and that's it. That's all you get. I even took this apart, and there's no lock on it, nothing. It's a one-time use blade. That's just so chintzy. It's just a throwaway blade, and it's rounded off. <laughs> I think it's rounded off on purpose. That is just hilarious. That is <laughs> that's just... Wow, I just made my day there. Um, so here is the bottle opener. Well, luckily that stays in. The handle's like a Vera type handle. It's got some grip to it. Casting's a little uh, overdone there. <laughs> Does have a hole. Get some leverage out of it, I guess. And then the uh, hex pattern here to prevent uh, rollaways but that's quite an extension there on a bottle opener <laughs> my gosh this is this is very interesting um so you have a, a guide here it's taped onto the back this is taped on the outside on the back it's just a piece of tape on it underneath the uh, plastic over wrapping um so at least you have a guide here to let you know that everything's there uh, it was very interesting that uh, they took a few out of each one of these to make an extra day. I guess uh, that was a last minute uh, thought there. <laughs> oh man, it's five. Okay, so five on these. And they took one each out to make a day there. And a day there. Got some other numbers here. Wow. <laughs> they, uh, the bits are a few of them have mason and then a few have the metal so you got uh two four six eight bits all the uh drill bits all together two four six eight there you go and then the reamer very interesting reamer there and we have a six no oh yeah five a six um they're all magnetic eight 10 and 13 there and then the holder let's check this out it's like it all holds together there's tons of wiggle room there let's see if there's well they do lock good this one has the least amount of wiggle let's try this one no, not too bad Got a lot of a uh, wiggle there. So uh, there's that. Flashlight's dead. I don't think that's ever gonna come back. I've never seen flashlights being shipped with batteries inside of it. That's crazy. Malt Max. <laughs> wow. I don't think that's the positive side. That's yeah, the positive side there. Yeah. It's dead. And then we have, uh, it's just a level, no magnetized, it's aluminum. It looks like it has a stylus uh, rubber pad here. It does have hit the bit holder in the end. Doesn't feel like it's magnetic though. Nope, not magnetic, just all plastic. Looks like there's a mag no, no magnet in there. It's all plastic. I don't know how a bit's supposed to stay in there. <laughs> but, uh, very interesting. Level works okay, I guess. <laughs> and uh, all your bits here. Looks like it uh, has Posi Drive, T10, all the way up to extras of T25s, T20s, all the way to T40. And then a whole bunch of extras of pH 2, pH 1, hex 4, hex 6, and hex 5, I believe. And hex 5 is right here. You got the more posi drives here. And a pH 3. 
So there you have it. Um, I'm just gonna take this and there we go. <laughs> okay, and that's about that about wraps it there. Not too bad. Uh, I forgot how much I paid for this. Uh, I think I got it on eBay. So um, yeah, definitely that was fun. <laughs> So, uh, Merry Christmas, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Yeah, hit the like, hit the subscribe, and on to the next one.